Hello, beautiful people. Thank you so much for joining. I know you guys haven't seen me on schedule <laughs> lately, but I definitely have an explanation for that. And I'll share that with you in a few. This is my ninth month locked. And I'm super excited. Time flew. I mean, honestly, it doesn't feel like it's been nine months since I started this journey, but when you look at the calendar, it definitely has been. <laughs> so, although I really don't have any changes to mention to my hair, I just wanted to at least come on and let you know that I don't feel like there's any changes. Maybe visually there are some and I just can't see them right now. But once I try to compare my hair this month to what my hair looked like in the last month's video, then maybe we'll see some changes. I don't know. Maybe you guys can see them now and I just can't. I am still washing my hair with water only every three to four days. And I feel like that has really been helping me it helps my scalp to not feel as itchy as it used to. It's helping me to not have the seborrheic dermatitis flare-ups like I used to. And uh, once every 10 days, I'd still use my medicated shampoo. And then in between that, I'll use my homemade shampoo, which I provided the recipe in the last video. So, sorry, actually the last lock update video so be sure to check that out and i'll put that up top so that you can just click on that once you're done viewing this one so i really don't have any complaints since the last time i gave you all an update on my locks i have not twisted my hair since june 26 and we are in august <laughs> so it's been a little over a month going without a retwist and it actually feels pretty good at first i felt a little insecure about it and there are some days where my hair just looks really special i'll just <laughs> i'll use that word it looks really special and then i'll just wear a turban and go about my day and then there's some days where it looks like it looks good to me so then i'll just wear it out so today is one of those days where I felt like it looked pretty good and I just swept it all to one side just to give you guys a little funky style without doing too much at the same time. So for starters, I definitely wanted to mention or bring to your attention for those that didn't really notice or maybe you did notice and you didn't understand why and what it was all about. I have changed my YouTube name from Miss china 627 to wheatless vegan and the reason why i've changed it is because all of my social media handles have wheatless vegan as my name and that is what i am <laughs> and if you want more information about how i became a wheatless vegan check out my last video which i'll put somewhere up there and you can check that out and i give you my story on how, when, why, and yeah. I know I mentioned to you all that I had a little surprise <laughs> in the last video. And I know you have been wondering like, what is the surprise that she's referring to? Well, you'll see it right So yes, that is what it looks like. <laughs> that is my baby bump. I am now 21 weeks pregnant, which is a little over five months. And I'm super excited and thankful and happy and busy. <laughs> it's like, that's why you guys haven't been seeing me like that, like on a tight schedule because I've been so busy. I work full time. And then, you know, I'm constantly cooking and trying out new recipes for myself because the cravings can be a bit 
much at times and I'll find or come across a recipe that I've never tried out before so I'll try that and then maybe I'll tweak it and it just gets really crazy. Um, not in a bad way, in a good way, but just to explain as far as why I've been so busy. So I'm constantly cooking and changing uh, old recipes or trying out new recipes. I'm also going to the doctor like every couple of weeks, <laughs> which I'm not used to that. So trying to incorporate that into my work schedule gets a little crazy. And I have also been working on my website, which I gave you a little sneak peek of it in the last video. <laughs> and it is weightlessvegan.com. And it's been on me, like on my heart to come up with this website to have a place where I can share all that I've learned so far on this journey, this new life journey of mine when it comes down to being vegan and eating wheatless and dealing with allergies, these food allergies that can be affected through some things that we would never even expect them to be. So, and I go over that in that video. So if you don't know what I'm talking about, check that out and then come back and listen to the rest of this video. <laughs> but um, yeah, I've been working on that. And I've also been organizing and planning the baby shower. And I've also been trying to create the baby registry and I'm trying to do it in a very thoughtful way. So your girl has been really busy. I'm like juggling, but I'm not complaining. It's not a bad thing at all. It's all good. And to add to that list, I've also been doing a lot of research for my health as well as the baby's health. So, yes, I am still a wheatless vegan, even in my pregnancy, and that's completely fine. My doctors know about it, and they okay it, and they actually think it's healthier than doing it any other way. So, on that note, I'm good health-wise. <laughs> so now, back to this lockup day. I know I just dropped like all these bombs for you all and now I'm gonna talk about hair again. But yeah, so I'm gonna give you guys a close up of my hair so you can see what it looks like and I'll do a side by side compared to last month's and let's see if there's anything that changed. So I hope you all have enjoyed this video and I can't wait to share so much more information with you all. And I thank you so much for supporting as usual. And if you would like to stay in touch even closer than we are through YouTube, you can always follow me on Twitter or Instagram and Snapchat by following Wheatless Vegan. That is my name and I'll post it down here so that you can see exactly how I spell it and let's communicate let's stay in touch let's keep this thing going thank you all for watching bye